what's going on YouTubians? I'm on my way to the flea market. I'm thinking about buying more livestock. What am I gonna get? We're gonna find out. Woohoo! We're almost to the flea market, everyone. You're probably wondering, what kind of flea market are you going to? It looks like you're just driving down a goofy old road. And I am. So, word up, guys. See what we can get into. Over and out. We are here, amigos. I love going to the flea market. Even though it's freaking 50 miles away. But I find some good stuff here. Make some good memories. We're going to document one today. Here we go, guys. About to go in for the swoop. Oh, yeah, guys. I bought something. It's in here. What is it? We're going to find out. Boom, it's a 58 caliber muzzleloader, you guys. But that's not all I have. Boom, 38 special, son. Picking up on the deals today. There's no farm animals, though. So, at least not what I'm looking for. Sadness all around. Glad to be here. See what else I can find. Breakfast of champions, everyone. It's a brownie, and I made it, and it's delicious. Oh, I have a serious problem, a serious problem. Not a 12 gauge, guys. I got another one, another steal of a deal. 200 bucks, semi-auto 12 gauge, and a water bottle. No, that was already there. So yeah, scoring at the flea market is a good day. Over and out. Everyone, we're going for like round six in the flea market, and that's what we're doing. Round six. See what else we can find. Woohoo! Going back for round six. See what else I could find at this awesome flea market. That's me. This is me right now. So, let's see what we could do. I bought a trap. All right, have a $3. Big spender. Oh, yeah, headed back to the car. You know which one I'm going to. <laughs> all right everyone i am back home from that awesome flea market they didn't have what i was looking for farm animal wise but hopefully next week they'll have what i'm looking for is it a rabbit is it a turkey is it a guinea pig hard to say i ain't telling you're gonna have to find out so stay tuned all right youtubians back again a week later still gonna see if i can find some livestock so it's five in the morning it takes me an hour to get there so, see you when I get there. I'm at the flea market. I just bought something. It's a black bear tooth. That's silver capped. You know why I bought that? Because I like wearing that kind of jewelry. Well, I'm going to go over here and check out the animals. See if they have anything. And if they don't, then I guess I'm going home empty handed. And I will see you on the next one. We are at the flea market. I'm making friends. Love it. Hey. Hello, <laughs> well, ladies and gentlemen, there were better days to buy farm animals that is not today because every other week they had them and now as soon as I wanted to make a cool little video about me getting some goofy little farm animals you know they don't have them why who knows because that's just how it is where they at though I'm gonna keep looking maybe next week I'll find some but in the meantime boom black bear tooth I get to you know switch it up every now and then so I'll pick you guys back up next week. Maybe we'll score. Maybe we won't. You guys will find out either way. What's up, everyone? I'm at the flea market again. I am selling today. See my table? Isn't it cool? Cool looking table. Didn't sell too much. But I did buy a few things. I'm going to wait till I get back home and I'm going to show you guys. Still no farm animals. Maybe next time. That's an island in that pond. Yeah, everybody needs their own island. Headed to Friendship. 
Yeehaw! I'm at Friendship, everyone. Ain't it awesome? It's always awesome. Especially when I'm here. But we're going to try to walk around the flea market, find some deals today. I don't know how much filming I'm going to be doing because I don't want some old guy to take my phone and smash it because he don't want to be on camera. So I'm probably just going to show the finds of what I'm buying, tell you the prices, and yeah, cool beans. The face you make when someone steps on your toe. This is the moment you all have been waiting for. I'm sorry this wasn't the traditional GoPro strapped to my chest, walk around the flea market kind of deal. But I tried my best. It's sort of weird because the kind of stuff I buy, people don't really want you videotaping it. So let's get into my finds. First up, we got the Jeremiah Johnson Blaster. It's a 58 caliber muzzle loader. I spent 70 bucks on it. That's right, 7 0. What a steal! It's at least a couple hundred dollar rifle, I would assume. So, yeah, I'm gonna be feeling like Jeremiah Johnson. Moving on. 12 gauge semi-automatic Citadel. I paid 200 bucks for it. They're like 250 new. So, oh yeah. Taurus 38 Special. Spent a little too much than I wanted to on this one, but that's fine. Spent 300 bucks. I can get my money back out of it, or I can find a nice trade and trade it off for something, something else. The weirdest gun I have ever seen in my life. This is a single shot 380. It's an Altor. You screw the barrel off, you slide the bullet into the rivets the bullet's supposed to go in, you screw the barrel back on, take the safety off, that's your trigger. You pull that back, then you let it go. And that's the firing pin hitting the primer and igniting the powder, which shoots off the bullet. Okay, Highway 420. He wanted like 10 bucks for it. I told him I'd give him five. He said eight, and I was like, nah, you know, I'll give you, give you five. He's like, all right, I'll give me five. So I gave him six because cause I'm a good boy. Get good juju. Moving on. Anybody have any quick guesses? My dad taught me a lot of things, and spending money on unnecessary crap was one of them. Whoosh. Good thing I didn't spend any money on these. I traded for them. What did you trade, Chief Smokem? Whoosh, I traded multiple candy strike knives, plus dude gave me some cash. So that's always good. I'm trying to get rid of these candy stripes. If you know anything about celluloid handle, then you'll know why I'm getting rid of them. But this is what I found. I am absolutely in love. Look at that. Beautiful. Chief Smoking Bloods, his weapons. Yep, pretty cool. Couldn't pass these guys up. So, but... Again, this is not everything I bought. What else do you buy, Chief Smokem? We seen you with a black bear tooth. Well, let me show it to you guys. Whoosh. Here they are, everyone. My black bear claws, my black bear teeth, and a black bear penis. Yes, everyone, that is a real black bear penis. I don't know why I bought it, but I got it now. I'm the only one in the world to have a cap black bear penis. It's cool. I bought that one the first day. It is a black bear canine. They're all supposed to be silver capped. I spent $35 on it. Then I bought these for the next week. I spent $175 on all of them. A couple claws, a tooth, and a penis. And then at Friendship, I got this off my buddy John. If you don't know John at Friendship, you're missing out. I spent 80 bucks for it. I like the paw in the middle and that little black stone. I don't know if that's onyx or what. But yeah, pretty cool. This whole video was based around me buying some farm animals. Which I have a confession to make. I did buy them. But that was before I decided to make a video. So, let's go outside and I'll show you what I got. Oh no, there they are. Acting like I just didn't feed them a half hour ago. 
Eternix quail, everyone. The two white ones are snowflakes, and the brown one is a jumbo. I've had a few more, but they just kept dying on me. I'm not sure what I'm doing wrong. Well, I know what I did wrong the first night. I put them in here because I didn't have the coop yet, and something had a little snacky snack. $5 piece snacky snack. That's what I'm going to try to do. I'm going to try to raise quail. And I just decided to make a goofy little video after I already bought some, but I was going to get some more if they had some. So, yeah. You know what? Want to know what else I got? Rosie! There's Rosie. My new hen. I don't know why, but I got a Rosie now. And she's cool. She lets me pet her. Dorothy stopped letting me pet her, so... Rosie's my favorite now. Thank everybody for sticking around for the ride. I know this wasn't a top-notch yard sale video, which it is what it is. I'm not going for top-notch. I'm going for memories and documenting them. I think Rosie's behind me. Yep, there's Rosie. We're going to the tomato patch. I'm going to let her get a few tomatoes. Come on, Rosie. Get you a tomato. Oh yeah, she's vicious. Enjoy everyone.